Hey, welcome to this Windows channel, and this is the check of antivirus Avast. Avast, that is the free version. So if you um, have no antivirus, one of the other free antivirus that's quite popular uh, after AVG is Avast. For a long time, I would have, um, you know, I, I, this was a, a choice for free antivirus because it was rather good. But as time grew by, um, I, after a while, I decided that this was getting way too big, too bloated, was slowing down, um, especially slower and older computers. And I switched away and decided that, you know, maybe Windows Defender was an okay choice. So. 2016 version of Avast free antivirus uh, installs easily, no junkware at start, but little bits of pop up here and there about their protections. Um, iCar test is um, half and half. When I created the virus and saved it on the desktop, it didn't say nothing. And when I clicked on it to open the file, it didn't say nothing either. So that's a bad point. If I scanned the file, it did say, oh, this is a virus. No good. But, um, you know, the object of the antivirus is to catch it before we click on it. Not the other way around. Uh, zipped download was blocked immediately, though. So that is good news because it actually immediately saw that there was a virus in the zipped file and blocked the download didn't even get on the computer so that was good malware unfortunately both software that I downloaded it didn't say nothing I clicked on it to start the install it didn't say nothing and I scanned and it didn't say nothing so that's a big no and uh, it's sad because it didn't really detect well that processor is less than 3% used Memory, about 40 megabytes idle, uh, 110 megabytes when it's scanning files. The 2.3 gigabyte file scan took 59 seconds, which is a little slower than the fastest, but a little uh, f more, much faster than the slowest. Though, you know, I'm that's not something that really changes much of my uh, score because... I prefer that it takes a little more time and have the impression it's checking it um, more thoroughly, basically. It does have web extensions, so when I go to, uh, say, um, Google Chrome, and if I try to search for something, it's actually going to tell me with little um, green check marks what's good or not in a search. But, thing is, look at here. It didn't give me all, it doesn't work like all the time for some reason. It sometimes does and sometimes doesn't. So it's kind of weird. Really weird. It's, it seems to be like working but half of the time for some reason. Startup impact is high and it does slow down the startup of my computer. It does slow down uh, web browsing a little bit. So, um, but not that much, but enough that, you know, if you have an older computer, you might see a big difference. It has optimization stuff. It told me, for example, Firefox was old, uh, stuff like that. Uh, that's okay, but, uh, I mean, um, you know, not necessarily uh, something that I like. But what I did like is the fact that when it tells you that, it updates it by themselves without having to, you know, do anything about it. And that's cool. But, no sandbox mode, no firewall. This is really a basic protection. Uh, I gave it a score of 4.5 out of 10 for the simple reason that no malware doesn't detect anything. And that I had to scan the file that I created before it told me there was a virus. Uh, but the zip download was good. So there's some form of protection, but it's very basic, basically. So Avast Free. 4.5 out of 10, not a big score. Um, I think you're better off probably with Avast, uh, AVG, sorry, than uh, Avast. So um, I will be checking out the AVG free, by the way, uh, because I did AVG Internet Security, and 
you know sometimes there could be a difference in the protection from the paid to the free version uh, even Avast as a paid version would be interesting to probably see the difference between the paid and the uh, free version so this was the Avast free 2016 test if you enjoy my videos why not subscribe to my channel you'll be informed when new videos are online give us thumbs up if you like the videos and hope you enjoy the videos thank you for watching